Title, Titanic sub offer turned down by Vegas Tycoon, was it a stroke of luck? TL, DR, a daring opportunity to explore the remnants of the Titanic turned into a tragedy for five individuals on board the ill-fated Titan submarine. However, a Las Vegas businessman, Jay Bloom, had a stroke of luck when he declined the offer to be a passenger on the doomed vessel. Bloom shared text messages with Ocean Gate CEO Stockton Rush, revealing his son's apprehension about the expedition. Could Bloom's decision to stay ashore have saved his and his son's lives? In a shocking turn of events, a catastrophic incident unfolded during a voyage to explore the wreckage of the legendary Titanic. The Titan submarine, owned by Ocean Gate, encountered a fatal implosion, resulting in the tragic loss of five lives. Among the potential passengers who turned down the ill-fated invitation was Las Vegas tycoon, Jay Bloom. Ocean Gate CEO, Stockton Rush, made a last-minute offer to Bloom and his son, presenting a discount of $100,000 per head for a remarkable total savings of $200,000. Despite the allure of the journey and the significant price reduction, Bloom's intuition guided him to reject the opportunity, a choice that now stands as potentially life-saving. Bloom shared a series of text messages exchanged with Rush, providing a glimpse into the conversations leading up to the Titanic expedition. The messages revealed Bloom's son expressing clear apprehension about embarking on the voyage. Bloom, understanding his son's unease, ultimately made the decision to decline the offer, a decision that he undoubtedly views as a stroke of luck in hindsight. While Bloom's instincts prevailed, the tragedy surrounding the Titan submarine leaves us questioning the risks involved in such ambitious explorations. How does Ocean Gate ensure the safety of their passengers in extreme environments like the deep sea? Are these ventures worth the potential dangers they pose? As we delve into the world of underwater exploration, it becomes crucial to consider the delicate balance between adventure and caution. The Titanic disaster has long captured the imagination of millions, with numerous expeditions seeking to uncover its secrets and pay tribute to those lost. However, incidents like the implosion of the Titan submarine remind us of the inherent risks that accompany such endeavors. As we reflect on Jade Bloom's fortunate decision to decline the ill-fated Titanic sub-offer, we are prompted to ponder the unpredictable nature of life and the choices that shape our destinies. In a parallel universe, could Bloom and his son have joined the fateful voyage, becoming victims of the tragic implosion? What are your thoughts on this chilling twist of fate? Share your opinions and join the conversation.